Hi, I'm Michael Coburn, Product Manager for Percona Monitoring and Management, also known as PMM. In this brief video, I will use PMM to highlight a high traffic event. A high traffic event can occur based on your own schedule, such as an important product launch, or a sales event such as Black Friday or the holidays in December, or perhaps an unscheduled, such as a newsworthy event that leads to increased traffic to your website or application. This traffic increase means your MySQL database will need to answer more queries than usual, and we'll go through some of the key metrics available to you in PMM. We'll begin with the summary dashboard, which combines both Linux, hardware, and MySQL metrics. In particular, we can see that during a high traffic event, the CPU of your MySQL database instance generally will increase as your database comes under increasing load. You may also notice that network traffic will generally increase as your application servers are generating queries to the database at a higher rate. Related to network traffic, the I.O. activity and disk latency metrics can often fluctuate, since more application queries generally will put pressure on your durable disk storage in two directions. First, an increase in read activity as less data is potentially served from RAM, and second, an increase in writes as database records are persisted to disk. As we scroll down the dashboard, we notice a large increase in MySQL queries. This is a leading indicator that you are undergoing a high traffic event as your application servers generate more questions of the database. On this dashboard, we have the top MySQL commands graph, which helps us understand which kind of queries are represented in the MySQL queries increase. In this case, we can see that the bulk of the queries are of the type select, but also an increase of types update, insert, and delete are observed. Another useful dashboard worth reviewing during a high traffic event is the trends dashboard, which helps you understand your performance across three time periods. Now, yesterday's activity, and activity from one week ago. With this information at hand, you can visually compare the high traffic event against historically observed values from within a single dashboard. I hope that you have found this brief video on using PMM during a high traffic event helpful. Thanks for watching.